Code for Christ is a Christian organization. We're a group of developers who are focused on sharing and advancing the gospel, but we're really passionate about writing software too. So we decided to combine the two things together and create software that shares the gospel, equips the saints for ministry. Code for Christ has been around for two semesters, and last semester we started developing our very first app. So what is this app, and what have we been up to? All the ways of a man are clean in his own sight, but the Lord weighs the motives. Commit your works to the Lord, and your plans will be established. These are just a few of the Proverbs that are found in the book of Proverbs. At Code for Christ, we're working on an app to bring the book of Proverbs to Christians around the world in a way that they could easily study it by receiving notifications throughout the day on their cell phone, and also sorting out verses that are particularly meaningful to them into savable categories, which they can revisit. Let's learn more about Proverbs Box and its features and its development from Code for Christ developer, Ha Young Kong. Thanks, Matt. So our Proverbs Box app displays two versions of Proverbs. There is the King's James version, which is this, as well as the Lexem English version, and we're planning to add more translations in the future. There are also two different modes for users. There is the article mode, which displays many verses like this, as well as a statement mode. So the user can view each verse separately, individually, like this. You can also favorite the verses you like to view them later, as well as searching for a proverb by entering a keyword, something like this. And it'll show all the proverbs with that keyword. And if you're feeling curious, we also have a discover section for people who would like to be inspired and discover a new proverb, like this one. Thank you, Ha Young. We have a lot of other project ideas that we can't wait to get started on once we deploy Proverbs Box 1.0. Now, let's find out what it looks like to be a member of Code for Christ. At Code for Christ, you will dive deep, contributing to the Code for Christ project whether that's contributing to a UX UI design or writing code. At Code for Christ, we follow an agile scrum workflow, which means that weekly we meet and every member discusses what they have completed during the past week, what they plan to complete during the next week, and any roadblocks are keeping them from completing their plan. Since school is a major commitment for students at USC, at Code for Christ, we value being a student first. You don't have to be a full-time developer to be a valued member of Code for Christ. Since we follow a Scrum Agile workflow, you can contribute as much or as little as you're able to and still be an important member of the team. If you're working on a task that's bottlenecking the project, there's always other members who can step up and lend a helping hand. So who are we looking for to join the Code for Christ team? First, we're looking for Christians who love Jesus and want to see Jesus Christ magnified. More specifically, we're looking for Christians with a background in software development or are interested in UI UX design. We've talked a bit about what a software developer might use to develop our apps. However, to share tools that a design team member might use, let's hear from Code for Christ member, Joanna May. Thanks, Matt. For non-software developers, our club offers roles for those interested in UX UI design. We currently use Figma to create mock-up app designs. This is one of the examples that we are currently working on for one of our apps. Here you can see basic icons, features, notifications, and buttons that you would be in charge of creating a design for. Thank you, Joanna. At Code for Christ, we live by the verse, whatever you do, do heartily, as unto the Lord. That's Colossians 3.23. This looks different for everyone, but for us at Code for Christ, we feel called to use our skills in developing apps to equip the saints. If you would like to be a part of Code for Christ, seeing Jesus Christ magnified in software, I think you would be a great fit for the team. Reach out to us at codeforchristusc at gmail.com. Thank you.